Hey, what's up? This is Ricky Burke of CyberSec People. Um, so this is the CSP vlog number 11. Um, so a huge, huge thank you to um, all those people that have been uh, contacting me, messaging me, uh, the subscribers. I'm up to 100 subscribers on YouTube. So thank you for that. Um, so before I go into things, um, I'm wearing one of my favorite con tops today. Uh, so this is the B-Sides Perth logo. So I think the guys did such an awesome job with that. Um, so B-Sides Perth uh, running two years. Um, I'm sure a conference is confirmed or will be confirmed at some point for 2019 soon. So you, you guys have done an amazing job. And this is one of my favorite logos, so thank you. Um, my my message today is is not infosec it's not um, careers it's um, a little bit different um, but it's something that concerns me a lot um, so we're, we're coming up to Christmas it's a great time of year for many different reasons uh, lots of social gatherings and you know seeing friends and um, you know yesterday we had our cybersec people um, um, Christmas function so um, I didn't have one last year uh, it was just me so it seemed a bit pointless doing it with one person um, now there's two of us um, we, we went and played um, sort of crazy golf at a pretty cool place in Melbourne um, and then went for, for some nice food um, I'm not going to say who won the crazy golf but um, you know it was it was fun it was fun either way um, my message today is, is I said a bit different but like, um, what concerns me um, is the economy has, has been good for a long time. Um, nine, ten years, Dow Jones up 200 plus percent, I think it is, um, from the lows of, of 2008, uh, around 2009. Um, Australia's not seen a recession in 20 odd years, um, but there is a lot of crap going on right now. Now, where am I going with this? There are a lot of people living beyond their means and maybe they're finding things tough right now. Um, and especially approaching Christmas, there's always an expectation of, quite frankly, spending a lot of money on presents and gifting people lots of things. Now's a good time to take a step back. Um, so look, at some point, the wheels are gonna fall off um, the, the cycle of the economy. Um, things do move in cycles and at some point, things are gonna change and look, Hopefully I don't. Hopefully I don't. Hopefully I'm I'm wrong. But at some point, something I expect to change. And if you're struggling now, it's going to get a hell of a lot worse um, when things do go bad. And the, the problem is there's there's a generation of people that have never seen a, a recession. Um, and honestly, when things go bad, they go really really bad. Um, having lived through um, some tough times in the UK, we had a recession when. They didn't experience one in Australia uh, around sort of 10 years ago or so. They managed to start, sidestep that for various reasons, which I won't go into, but let's just say that's why we have a, a massive uh, inflated property market now. Um, it, things got tough. Um, I, I live, uh, or my, my family business, um, you know, went through some tough times and, and basically went from, uh, I think it would have been sort of 12 to 14 people down to two people. Um, and it's it's tough when you see things like that and you're living through that. Um, you know, there, there'll be a lot of people out there that might have their own businesses that may be working for other people. But the fact the fact is, a lot of people um, are not not living far enough away from having savings. So they might be one, two, or three months away from things going, having nothing effectively. Um, so. It's a big message, it's not a happy one, but it's a sensible one. Um, Christmas, try and start being sensible. We're all guilty, or a lot of us are guilty, buying crap for the sake of it. Um, now's a good time to, to pull back on that and try and be more meaningful. Because um, if you can start doing that now, go into next year with a lot clearer head um, in terms of how you go about, quite frankly, keeping more money instead of spending it, um, then you'll You'll be better off for it, and especially if things go wrong. And if I'm if I'm wrong, and things don't go wrong, you're in an even better place. Um, so it's a strange message, but again, it concerns me a lot. Where I see a lot of uh, wastage out there, um, and I'd love to see people better off, uh, especially uh, if things do unfortunately go the wrong way in the next maybe two, three years or something. Um, so in the meantime, uh, blog number eleven. Thank you. Um, we have um, some really cool stuff lined up next week. So. 
I'm still running these uh, vlogs every day. I'm hoping to add some value either way. Um, on Monday, I have got a hacking and security video with one of my friends who's an absolute gun pen tester. Um, so as long as his availability doesn't change, then there'll be a video on that coming very early next week. Um, I've got some more cool people lined up as well to share their stories and insights. Um, and even some companies um, speaking to some sort of managers and business owners. Um, asking them what they look for when they're hiring people. So again, the more value we can add um, to tell you what you should be looking for and, and some strategies and how you can go and land a job, um, hopefully that's going to help some people directly uh, pick up their first job or transition into security. Um, in the meantime, it's Friday. Have a great weekend. Take care.